first of all, I'd like to say that re European research must address various important health uh, challenges. But one of these is that we have a strong need for research in multimorbidity in the aging population because uh, the European citizens keep aging. And on the one hand, this is a privilege, but on the other hand, an increase in life expectancy also leads to, to age-related diseases. So this leads to multimorbidity and disabilities to a much higher extent than we have seen before. So we need the research in age-related diseases, including research in the interaction between different diseases and their treatment. Oral and dental health. Given the importance of healthy mouth, healthy teeth, let's say for being able to eat healthy food, to, to have healthy nutrition, for communication, for social contacts. I think this area deserves more attention and it relates very well to other to priorities such as uh, being healthy throughout the life cycle, for instance, healthy aging and so on. It also relates to the issue of equal access to healthcare which in this case is very important because, of course, to maintain healthy teeth, healthy uh, oral cavity, one needs to have access to high quality health services. So this is one area which I think should be mentioned. There are, of course, multiple health challenges for European research to address, and precision medicine is one of them. Precision medicine means using large data sets about the individual patient to guide treatment of the disease. So we're moving away from a one drug fits all, which actually never was the case, to more individual data-based assessment. Cancers, for example, are very different between patients and European researchers help to guide the doctor's decision making on an individual case. This is going to transform healthcare, and we are only just at the beginning of this journey. Be preserving privacy of individuals without hampering useful research, especially in medical emergency situations. This means also increasing opportunities for health data exchange for both healthcare and research aims. This point uh, should be applied uh, to many types of data, from data reuse uh, to improvement of data collection, also with direct involvement of patients or people and organizing data collection and research purposes, including access of data for broad and future scopes. The last key word I think should be reinforced in the future European calls is sustainability of healthcare, including development of sustainable new therapeutic, diagnostic or preventive approaches. It means by such economic risk benefit profile and especially environmental point of views.